Hey guys, JP Does Code here. Um, today I'm making another video. Um, so today we are going to talk about different world technologies and how they affect our society. Um, so AI. AI really does have the potential to change the world. Recently I've had the chance to meet uh, Pepper, which is an AI learning assistant. Um, after actually meeting and trying to have conversations with it, um, you really get to see how immature these AI technologies are. And it really does need a lot more work until they're able to be functioning parts of society, especially with how, uh, with how much limited information they have and things of that nature. Pepper was really fun to experience and it did have some really cool things about it, but um, it had just as many uh, flaws as it did advantages. So that's something that really needs to be looked at before um, going on and to the, going on to the next stage and trying to commercialize this towards schools and third world countries to try to help with the education system and things of that nature. But this is definitely a start and I definitely see this going somewhere. Just it needs more time to be developed. Um, technology and democracy. Uh, we are in a point in society where technology is just about everywhere. And um, a question that needs to be asked is how much technology will be necessary in society as we advance? So th this is a really big topic. Like, are we going to end up in a society where we have complete automation, things of that nature. And this really comes with time. I feel like with more time, the more automation that will come. And this will lead to big changes in societies. Um, so that leaves us at another weird question. Since we're going in a time where technology will be so prevalent, will we have to change how society works to revolve around the increase in technology? This is a question that I honestly don't have the answer to, but I believe that we will. But this really comes with time and just seeing how things go. And technolo technology is an incredible thing. There's so much we can do that we probably haven't even comprehended yet. So we don't even know what kinds of technology will be coming in the future. So this is very open-ended, but it's a very good topic to think about. And that goes into our last section which is about the digital divide if you don't know what the digital divide is it's the difference in information between somebody who has access to the internet and somebody who doesn't with the increase in the amount of information that gets added to the internet every day this is this leaves people without access to internet at a very low uh, very big disadvantage um, like i said here um, leaves lower income households at a disadvantage. Um, if you can't afford internet, how are you gonna access it? Or if you don't have a technology that has internet capabilities, there's no way you're going to access the internet. So this leaves these people at a big disadvantage because there's so much more information on the internet than there is at libraries, especially nowadays. It not, wasn't always the case, but this is changing with the increase in information that's being added to the internet, such as like Wikipedia and all those other resources. Wikipedia is just one. And that leaves a question, should schools support these students that do not have uh, access to the internet or um, have devices that are capable of going online? And these are things that we should start thinking about as a society that we haven't thought of thought of enough yet and i'm not saying we haven't at all but it's something that really needs to be looked at especially with the way society is going um so that is my little presentation on different world technologies and how they affect our society um so 
If you like the video, please like and subscribe to the channel. If you have any questions, feel free to message me on any of my socials. It's JB Does Code. There's no spaces on uh, Twitter and LinkedIn, but feel free to DM me on any of those, leave a comment, um, and I hope you enjoy.